with Arsenal then. Are they still a work in progress? And are they still City's closest challengers? Uh, so, you know, every every team is a work in progress, no matter where you think you are. So I think they're absolutely fine. I didn't see anything anything wrong other than putting away their opponent. I mean, they, they should have won that 4-5-0 or five nil easily. We know that games like that uh, do come through. Uh, I don't worry about Arsenal at the moment. Yes, they are. Uh, you know, I had him second, just like last season. Uh, I don't see anything that would change my mind. Uh, the one thing that changed my mind, something that you've asked me continuously, and I was a non-believer, was Eddie Nketia. This is a player that needs to start now, even when Gabriel Jesus play, plays. And for those of you that listen to me all the time, you know that's a complete 180. You know, I have to grow into him, uh, but he comes in, he does his job. Uh, when he plays for the start, he's fine as well. I don't see any problems with that last result other than, of course, yeah, you know, you're playing at home and you should, should be getting th three points. They certainly deserved it and, and ultimately didn't see it through, but way too early for, for me to even worry about uh, Arsenal. And are they the biggest challenges then to City? Yeah, yeah. Right. Uh, at this point, you have to say, I mean, you look at Manchester United, we've talked about it in Liverpool, you know, I mean, it's certainly not not there to, to do it. We don't think Chelsea are. We've seen that Newcastle are dropping points left and right uh, at the moment. Uh, um, and I think that, you know, Arsenal dominated every game they've played so far. Thank you very much for watching ESPN FC on YouTube. For more highlights, analysis and exclusive content, be sure to subscribe.